Welcome to Atlanta, Georgia, a city that in the last few years has started developing a real local craft beer scene. So I will be checking out a few of the uh, kind of newer breweries that are uh, getting some buzz and I will give my own personal evaluation of them. De Leon Avenue, pretty important street in Atlanta. And the first brewery that will be checked out, checking out is Torched Hop, which is also a restaurant. Not really sure what looking this is. up selecting a coconut porter, specifically the Bracunas Coconut Porter. I actually tried three of them, uh, samplers, Fruity Lucy and the Darkness Becomes Chocolate. Uh, didn't really blow my mind either of them, uh, although Darkness Becomes Chocolate 9.5% and it was pretty smooth, so that's cool. Kind of a chocolate beer, good dessert. And we have an 11.2 here, that's cool. So the one I picked, uh, it's fermented with toasted coconut flakes. It's got dark fruit and chocolate. It's pretty good. So another cool thing is the price. This huge beer, half a liter, four dollars for the house drafts. And all those ones that I just mentioned were all house drafts. That means they uh, make them here. So I don't know what kind of deals they have the other days, but even the regular prices are pretty good. They also have wine and other types of liquors. using proper safety masks. All right. That was the torch top. That beer was pretty good. Half a liter of 9% beer it definitely feels good. So, especially for $4, a so thumbs up for that. And, uh, Check out some more places tomorrow. Next up, Max Loggers. So in case you didn't feel like reading the description there, uh, I got the Demon Door, which was the Belgian triple, and it was pretty much excellent. Uh, also 9.7%, so I always like that. And it was incredibly smooth, uh, a little bit fruity, and just really delicious. Uh, I'd give that a, uh, like a 9.2 out of 10. So that was a, a great beer, and um, conclusion for me would be that uh, I should try more Belgian triples. It's worth noting that was a uh, also a house draft so uh, that beer was brewed on the premises. Um, the place itself seemed pretty cool, pretty classy. Uh, that beer was six bucks so not the cheapest um, but it was kind of dead but it is the day before Thanksgiving so uh, that might be a factor. But yeah, cool place. Great beer. Hey 
guys, so I'm currently in Alabama. Hope you enjoyed that tour of the best breweries in Atlanta. The day I made it, the video was the day before Thanksgiving. So a lot of the places were closed. Uh, so I was also planning on checking out Orpheus Brewing, uh, which is uh, near the north end of Piedmont Park, uh, which I have a uh, specific video for that I made as well. And um, yeah, so out of the two breweries, uh, I would pick Torch Brewery just for the kind of atmosphere and the, the look and feel of the place. Also the prices were, were better than Max's. Uh, but the Triple Belgium I had at Max's was just an incredible beer. Um, so, kind of tough to pick one over the other. Uh, I'd maybe give the slight nod to, to, to uh, Torch Tops. So, yeah, both were good and uh, there's some other uh, breweries that you can check out in Atlanta. So, uh, yeah, definitely a good spot to go if you uh, like beer. And if you're not familiar with my channel, currently bicycle touring from Canada to Argentina. Uh, and you can follow my adventures by going to my website, followthehumoftheearth.com, as well as subscribe to my YouTube channel. Have a good one.